Yeehaw! She's okay. She's a lot less creepy and like murderous than your other attempts. <laughs> she definitely looks a little less like she's gonna murder me and a little bit more like she might poison my soup and make me fall in love with her or something. <sighs> Had the other fill of the sights? Well, they appear to have almost finished. Oh boy. Oh boy. Okay. All right. Let's go. Please be voiced at the very least. I need to not have to talk for like several minutes. Sick. A glorious grand machine indeed. Thank you, Jesus. I hope Namika was able to secure a seat. Baby Jesus. Here she comes! Thanks to you, we managed to resume service much faster than anticipated. You have our gratitude. <sighs> ah, there's nothing so enchanting as a ceruleum-powered engine in motion! <laughs> Ain't that the truth. Don't think I'll ever tire of watching them chugging along. Oh, they make wagons look like toys. And so long as we can lay the tracks, she can go on and on and on. Before you know it, she'll be crossing the entire continent. Railroads are a somewhat recent addition to Tural. As it stands, we can only ferry folks as far as Yasolani. And from an operational standpoint, we still have much to learn. There's always some problem or another to deal with. But we'll keep working at it. We'll hone our craft and continue expanding till one day our trains are running coast to coast. That's the ultimate dream. Goodness, I completely lost track of time. By now, I expect the train will be nearing Yasolani. When it returns, we'll see you on your way. So if you've got any preparations to make, <laughs> you better make them quick. Not another one? You can't be serious. Gods have mercy. Um, 
I don't think that's supposed to be. What in the flying? What's happening? I don't think that's supposed oh, to train. Nitobikwe and the others. My home lies that way as well. Ugh. We're going to investigate right now. That's definitely not supposed to be there, right? That's definitely not supposed to be there. Oh my god. What the fuck? Oh my god, we've entered Star Wars. Oh my god. What the fuck? It's like that movie, Cowboys and Aliens. What in the world? Are they heading for Tuliolar? Huh. Hmm. 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 We need to follow that ship. I don't know how we're gonna get there faster than the ship, but we need to follow it. Oh, I know how we can get there faster than the ship. Slash me aetherites. For Fent. You're here. Good. Good. They came from the sky and attacked without any warning. The people need our help. That's a mount later in the game. Unrelated. Can you stand? Try to remain calm, everyone. Yeah. What the? Ah! Oh. I don't know what they are, but they're not men. This is the most confusing clash of everything that has ever happened in this video game, I feel like. I'm, s I'm getting whiplash. Someone help me, please! Oh. Oh. oh my god! Bastard! What did it just do? Thank you. Uh, save the things. Just get to safety. Guys, I can't go to bed now. I. Fuck. I'll hold the line here. Fall back to the palace. Quickly, before it's overrun. Thank you, Bakul Jaja.
You got this, Pakul. You're so much cooler than these guys. This is simply how I do things now. So, who wants to chase my blade next? Hot girl? Pause champ? Wait. Is she old enough to be a hot girl? Hold on. Double pause champ. me running with my stupid book. I look goofy as hell. Why do they have me with my fucking book out? I look stupid. What the fuck? That's sick. <laughs> Not gonna lie. He's an asshole, but that's sick. That you he kind of looks cool. Leave. So, Roger? By the gods, what has happened to you? This is your butchery, isn't it? After everything you've done in service to the throne, how could you betray us? My demand is simple. The dissolution of Tuli Yolol and surrender of all its territories. Pass. Refuse, and I will kill every last one of you. I've literally killed the end singer, bro. Who are you? Have you gone mad? <laughs> Loser? No. My ambition remains unchanged. To teach the masses the folly of war that they cry out for peace. And thus, unite the world. What has changed you so much, and in so short a time? To harm the very people you swore to serve. <sighs> this is an unforgivable deed committed by my son. My son! Yeah, the one you birthed and everything. That's fucked up. Your adoptive kids are so much cooler. I should be the one to do this. No. His sins are mine to bear. Fear not. Osoralja is strong. He has never been father's equal in combat. I believed you long dead. To have the chance to kill you myself is an unforeseen blessing. That's not him.
Farewell, Sorolja, my son. And forgive me. <laughs> <laughs> He just got revived. What the fuck? What? How? Despite his old age, the mighty Gulul Jaja remains a fearsome foe indeed. You retain the vitality of two souls, despite the passing of one. Hmm. I shall even the odds. Papa? No! Oh. Even the blessed are mortal. You are no match for me. Murderer, on my honor, has vow of resolve. I'll make you pay. Use your book. My book's not gonna help. I'm fucking useless. So the once faint-hearted girl would live up to her title. Very well. If only to demonstrate the disparity between us, I give you a chance to prove yourself. Rally the entirety of your strength. Lay siege to my kingdom. Strike me down like I did father. Then will you be his worthy successor? You pull your tank ass motherfucker. Wait! My warships will remain in your skies. When you fail to prove your worth, I shall order them to lay waste to Tuli Yolal. Choose your next steps wisely.
Bro, I'm a healer too. Why am I not healing? Why am I so fucking useless all the time? What is the point of me if I can't heal? No, Papa can't die. He can't. Don't make me cry over this motherfucker. Or I'm gonna freak out. How? How could this happen? Please be voiced. I physically cannot. If I if I have to voice it, I will cry. Saving. Father, please. You can't give up. Are you there, a oh friend? I'm right here. I'm right here. Look after my children. What? I'm an old fossil like you. I've only got so many years left. But if that's what you want, it would be an honor. You and I must go on another journey together someday. Hi, you can count on it. Yes, Papa. The graves of the Yokui. You saw them, yes? I always found their teachings comforting. <coughs> Please, Father, you must save your strength. Our flesh may wither and die, but so long as we are remembered, we are never truly gone. Through you, my hopes survive. Through you, I live on. So do not mourn me. Walk tall, and see your nation to a brighter future.
hindsight tells me I probably should have gone to bed, like, um, a while ago. Should have, I should have at least stopped questing. Anyways, uh, <laughs> oh, man. Hey, you know what? Her dad died, but I got a sick jacket, so... I mean, look at me. Am I not cool as shit? Do I not look like I just came out of like a Mad Max movie? Right. So, uh, I... Val Wuklamot, Valcona, I bring word from the city. The enemy has withdrawn and the lands guard have begun rendering aid to the people. I'm just gonna do this until it hits a point where I need to stop. Casualties within our ranks have hindered progress, but we continue to do all that we can. My nose is filled with boogers. I thank you for the report. Please inform the guard that they are to prioritize such efforts until further notice. I can't even do accents. My boogers are out of control today. The people. I need to help them. We will assist you in whatever way we can, of course. Daughters. Thank you, thank you. They are too sure to be wounded everywhere. More than I could count. We'll split up and help all of them. You can count on us. My nose is not doing well. I'm not doing well. Alfino and Alize, could you take Bayside Bevy and Kryle and Erinville, the palace perimeter? As for Alice, please come to the resplendent quarter with me. We'll all meet back here afterwards. That I'm not. <laughs> I don't know what to do right now. blood everywhere and there's bodies everywhere and you think i need to stop them you think i should stop there's people dying and i should stop <laughs> that's stupid I'm never going to stop. Ever.
you know, in a way, I'm kind of glad that I turned the background music off because I know when that motherfucker was dying, they were probably playing the saddest shit humanly possible. <sighs> Thank you. I thought I was done for. I heard something disturbing. The enemy leader, they say he looked like Zeralja. But that can't be true, can it? Why would the first promise attack his own people? But if it was him, what happens now? Is he gonna come back? What do we do if he does? I don't know, man. Kill him, I guess. I... I guess. I don't think that was him, though. I think his brain got taken over by someone or something. That felt weird. He was on some weird shit, man. Thank you. The pain is better now, but I can't stop shaking. Where did they come from? Why did they attack us? And why are those things still in the sky? We had peace under Gogol Jaja. We were safe. But now? Listen. <laughs> It's fine. Everything is fine. Thanks. I, I think I'm all right. Did you see them? The soldiers? They looked like people, but they killed and killed with no hesitation. If they attacked us again, how could we hope to defend ourselves? I don't know, man. I don't know, man. I don't know. I just know this jacket is sick. And I look cool as hell. Thank you, miss. But, but my husband and son, they were... They were... You don't have to fucking trauma dump me. I'm already fucking traumatized. Fuck. <sighs> My thanks. I'll be fine now. But we failed to protect the people. Why did so many have to die? Where were Val Wook and Lam Wook Lamotte and Valcona? They're not to blame. I understand. I do, but I need to clear my head. They were literally busy fighting their own brother to stop their dad from dying, bro. Like, what? Shut up, stupid idiot, dummy, dumb idiot, idiot. Frick. Sorry. I'm not mad at them. I'm just taking it out on them because I'm angry that he died. <laughs> I'm upset. I liked him walking around with his dead brother all the time. You finished aiding the people here? Yeah, I think so. Thank you. There were children among the wounded. Children? Yeah, I know, man. It's fucking sad. Can we not talk about it? No. Now isn't the time. There are still others who need help. Could you go and see how things are at Talon March? And afterwards, go and find Alize at Bayside Bevy. Yeah, okay. <sighs> There's no evidence of significant damage from the battle. The fighting did not spread this far, it seems. Well, that's good, I guess. <laughs> 
is some positive in the negative stuff that's happening right now. Yay, no damage. Fresh scorch marks on the ground are doubtless from the enemy assault. Yeah, man, probably. Look at these guys just out here crafting. <laughs> they're just they're just crafting while there's just bodies strewn everywhere and they can't even see them. I know they can't. The shop appears to have water weathered the chaos, though its wares have been strewn across the floor. Ah, oh, man. I thought this was supposed to be a light-hearted tale. I'm gonna be real, and I feel like I was lied to. The port remains unscathed, but the enemy ships continue to loom overhead. Jack could die well. Oof. Enable die. The best way to tell is to change the colors to wildly different colors. Shit, this die is great. What the fuck? So anyways, then I dyed it the same color as the rest of my stuff. <laughs> so anyways, then I went with red and black. I've helped all those I could find and seen them delivered into the Landsguard's care. As many casualties as there are, it would have been worse if the Landsguard hadn't fought as bravely as they did. And if Zeralja actually meant to harm the people? I mean, look around. The buildings are hardly damaged. I suspect his aim was more to incite fear. To show that he could strike whenever he pleases. But we can discuss that later. How's Yamati? Even after what happened to her father, she's trying so hard to fulfill her duty to the people. Still, everyone has their limits. She needs rest, and soon. Someone mentioned seeing her heads toward the shore. Perhaps she's gone to Gleam Sands. I tried. I did. Steady now. I've brought you medicine. Uh, drink. There you are, Lamachi. I was beginning to... Come on. Come on, take it, please. Lamachi. Lamachi! How? How could I? Look at me, Lamati.
You need rest. You and her both. I will tend to this soul. But... my... people... I have to help them. The Landsguard have matters well in hand. Trust in them. If there's another attack, your people will need you to protect them. They'll need you to be sharp. So please rest. Consider it your duty. I stood before them all, said that we'd build a nation where everyone knows happiness. So much for that promise. What good is a vow of resolve who cannot save her people? You'll stick with me. Thank you. My head's a little clearer now. I need to concentrate on what I can do, rather than what I can't. We've dealt with unfriendly factions before. From Yoquista longing for conquest, to adherents of blessed siblings, people who are unwilling to listen. Even so, I believe that by learning about one another and engaging in good faith, we could peacefully settle our differences. And we did. My brother is different. <laughs> What's more, he has power. The power to destroy the peace we've worked so hard to preserve. If I'm to protect that peace, then I must fight. I must confront Zorolja and kill him. I'm fine, just needed a moment to settle my nerves. Thank you for being there for me, and for urging me on despite all my soul kink. Sitting around complaining isn't very leader-like, is it? So much has happened so quickly I struggle to make sense of it all. The strange soldiers, those floating ships, the new power Zoral Jacques commands. Given everything he's done and still intends to do, I know I can't afford to run headlong into battle, not this time. I cannot let this terrible pain in my heart lead me astray, but I will make it my strength, the strength to do what I must. <laughs> right, I'm headed back to the palace. I need to talk strategy with Kona. Could you and the others join us in a, in a while? However we decide to proceed, I want you all to be aware of it. Oh, and could you tell Alice I'll be alright? She's probably at Bayside Bevy. Okay, I think I'm gonna, um... I'm gonna turn this question and then I'm gonna, uh... I'm gonna stop. I think it'll be a good time to stop.
Oh, you're back. By that, I take it to mean Lamati's feeling better. She needs to be strong for the people of Tural. I understand that, but she doesn't have to do it alone. So if she intends to fight, then we fight together. Daughters. That said, I wish I knew exactly what we were up against. Me too, man. And now I want to know what these pants look like really quickly. <laughs> Hold, please. Holy shit, I look cool as fuck. Holy fuck, I look cool as heck. Holy heck, I look cool as frick. Holy frick! Dude. <laughs> this is the outfit to end all outfits. I'm just saying. Okay, we'll accept this. And then we do not do it. It's clearly not a person, but it doesn't look like any automaton or magitech weapon I've seen. As far and wide as you've traveled, though, perhaps you've encountered something similar before. Would you mind taking a closer look? It may yield some clues as to Zeraldra's new powers. Okay, I'm gonna look at the body. And then I'm gonna stop. But that's only because it's gonna annoy me that the body's there the whole time. In place of where the eyes or a mouth might be, you see a strange sigil on the front of this helm. From a distance, it appears to be a simple armor, but upon closer inspection, its construction is quite intricate. The material from which it is made is unclear, and you see no signs of a power source. The general shape of this weapon resembles a gun, but its construction suggests it's far more advanced than anything you've seen before. I have no idea what that is. No clue. So what do you think? I don't know anything about this. <laughs> it looks like a person, but it's clearly mechanical, probably. I don't know. I don't have any knowledge in this field at all. <laughs> Indeed, while it re resembles a person, it has features that make it uncanny, like the lack of a face, not least of all. Do you see any sign of a power source? Not really. So it probably doesn't run on ceruleum or any other conventional fuels. I tried channeling Aether into it earlier, but there was no response. That would seem to rule it out as an arcane entity. It's completely lifeless now, a far cry from unstoppable enemy it was in battle. Even the materials it's made from is a mystery. Rather than metal, it's more akin to stone. Wait, haven't we seen this somewhere recently? Uh, the Sky Deep Cenote? That's right, the glowing stone used in the chamber with the gate to the Golden City. And while the soldiers are a different color, the warships are the same black as the stone of the gate itself. Canoledge time. So much canoledge. There has to be a connection. Let's share our observations with the others when we gather at Sunperch. The sooner we get to the bottom of this mystery, the better. Okay, I'm gonna not go to Sun Perch. All right, um, what did I say I was gonna do really quickly? Get off. I get off all the time, baby. Oh, I was gonna, um, Show you guys Haji really quick. Listen. Listen. All I want to know is um, that you guys don't give in your opinions on Haji because Haji is the world's greatest bun boy and he is my ideal bun and I don't care about anyone else's opinion but if someone looked like Haji they would be banged I would bang them they would be mine my bun <laughs> that would be my bun this my bun this bun my bun
This bun, my bun. This bun, my bun. Anyway, this bun, my bun. <laughs> um, yeah, anyway, uh, I hope that you guys enjoyed this stream. I will be back again tomorrow, I promise. I mean it, for realsies. I hope you guys have a good morning, afternoon, or night, wherever it is that you are. See you tomorrow. Hope you enjoyed the stream. It was another fat 10 hour stream. I'm hoping probably it probably won't finish it all tomorrow, but I might I might just grind the whole rest of the story out tomorrow. I might wake up early and just keep going until I'm done cuz I am tired of waiting it. No joke, you won't want to bet? You want to bet? You want to bet? Do you want to bet? Do you want to bet because I will take the bet. You going 16 hours? I fucking will. I've gone 30-something before. I'll fucking go 16. It's not that bad. <laughs> I, I've done it before. I'll do it again. Don't no-ball me, bro. I hate that shit. What do you want for a prize? Um, I want... 30 million gil. Want 30 million gil. A reward. I will grind the story all day tomorrow. I will wake up early tomorrow. I will wake up in... I can't do math soon. You're down to 78 mil? Yeah, all of it can go into my account, okay? You're robbing me right now. Robbing you fucking blind. Blind. You didn't have to say, you didn't have to say that there was going to be a prize. I would have done it for free, but you put the prize out there as an option. Remember this. <laughs> you put this out there. Will you take it? I'm just giving you the option. Anyway, I'm going to go. I'm going to chill, I'm going to do some dailies, and then I'm going to go to bed, and I'm going to wake up early, and we're going to do this until I'm done. And I can finally relax. Okay. Anyway, I hope you guys have a good morning, afternoon, night, wherever it is that you are, and I'll see you guys in two hours. Miss you, love you, bye. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Bye. Scatter. Yeah.